braking. As opposed to going through the red light and yes. killing us all? Yes. Which is what you would prefer. So you, <laughs> so you didn't have to do Hello and welcome to another reading vlog. It is currently Friday, August 14th at like 8.50. I'm sitting outside of my work because I don't want to go in yet because I start at 9. If you guys are new here, you don't know I got a new job. I work as an ECE, which is an early childhood educator assistant because I don't have my degree yet, but I'm getting it in January. But it's basically just daycare. But I don't want to go in because I'm early, so I'm going to wait like two or three more minutes. So I figured I'd open the vlog. I have not been reading or vlogging or making video content, so this is my solution. A reading vlog for the weekend. I don't know how much reading I'm going to get done because today I work till 5 30 and Saturday I am going to go look for a car because I need to buy a car because this is my parents car it's not my car and I need a car because I'm 24 and need to be a grown-up you know and then after I go look for a car I'm going to Will's house for the night and then Sunday I'll be spending with Will so tonight is our reading night Saturday we're gonna get some reading done before we go to the car lot and then hopefully after we go to the car lot we're gonna get a little more reading done and then sunday's a write-off we're not doing any reading but i'll vlog whatever me and will are doing but i'm gonna update you guys on like what i'm reading when i'm off work so at 5 30 i'll see you guys again because i need to go to work now womp womp you're the mail lady i'm the mail lady what is it this is a book they sent me two of those yeah, they sent me that already. Well, okay. I am finally home. It is 5.50, so now I can update you guys on what I'm reading this weekend. The first thing I'll talk about is the audiobook, because I always have an audiobook and a physical book on the go. The audiobook is Burn Our Bodies Down by Rory Power, and honestly, I'm 50% in, and I still have no idea what the heck is going on. I'm so confused on, like, the plot of this book. I did hear that it was, like, a female-female relationship. So far, 50% in, there's only been, like, mentioned that the main character, Margot, is a lesbian, but that's really the only thing. I'm assuming that Margot and Tessa, who are the only two girls the same age in the book, are going to get together. I don't know. I'm still very confused about what this book's about. I think I'm enjoying it, but like I said, I'm confused about what is happening, so I'm not really sure. Like, my 100% thoughts on it, but it's basically about this girl named Margot who lives with her mother and they're very similar But very different at the same time so they don't really get along So she decides that she's going to run away to live with her grandmother who she's never met before And it's like her going to this farm that her grandmother lives on But then there's like secrets on this farm and she's like trying to uncover the secrets because her mom has told her nothing about her past life I don't know. It's really weird. I'm very confused. So I'm going to be listening to that tonight while I do my <laughs> dailies on Animal Crossing of course. And then the physical book that I'm reading is called My Eyes Are Up Here by Laura Zimmerman. It's about this 15 year old who has very big boobs. She's very self-conscious about this and I believe that it's like the story of her becoming more self-confident in her big boobs and like coming to terms with them I guess. I'm only like 30 pages in so I'm not 100% sure if that is accurate or not but so far 30 pages in I am really enjoying it. The writing style is very comical. You can definitely tell that the main character is 15 by the way that she talks but I actually like prefer it like that because I know that she's 15 so I'm like she should be a little less mature than you know a adult. So I actually kind of like it that way. But like I said, I'm going to go do some Animal Crossing and listen to my audiobook. And then I'm probably going to read my physical book. Or not. I'm not really sure. I'm not seeing Will tonight because his cousin from Montreal is over. So I was like, y'all need to spend some time together since I'm coming over tomorrow. Just makes sense to have a day to yourself. Lots of reading is going to get done, which is good for this channel. Because like I said in the previous clip, I have not been reading and I have not been making content. So... I blame Will. Sorry.
I listened to more of the audiobook and then I got bored. I decided that I was going to catch up on reviews. I'm making this into a NetGalley vlog because I just realized that all of the books that I am reading are NetGalley arcs because all of the publishers aren't sending out uh, hard copies of books anymore so they're all on NetGalley. So I have a lot that they've sent me. So right now I've been approved for 36 and I have a feedback of 28 so my ratio is 78. I still have not made it to 80. I got to 79 and then I got sent another e-arc so I clicked it. Really what I should be doing is not clicking the widgets but I get so paranoid that they're going to like expire before I have the chance to read them so I click them all at once. The goal of this reading vlog is to get to 80 okay? Hold me to it people. Hold me to it. So it's on Saturday. I've spent the entire morning listening to Burn Our Bodies Down by Rory Power and I only have like 38 minutes left so I'm like 90% through the audiobook and I would still like to say I am so confused with what the heck is going on like they're explaining everything right now and I'm sitting here like hey like the way that the story was told made no sense for this big reveal like it does make sense but it's just like so unsatisfactory so I'm kind of disappointed because I was actually like really excited about that book also totally was wrong when I said that it was a female female relationship there's none it's not a thing i heard it from somebody that there was one but it's just that the main character is a lesbian with like nothing coming from that just the fact that she is a lesbian so ignore my comment from before when i said that there was a relationship because there's not my plan for the day is to basically just like bulk film a bunch of videos because um i've been spending too much time with will and therefore not filming anything and also not really reading anything like i said in the previous clips also like I'm working full-time so I'm also gonna blame that because I literally go to work at 7 come home anywhere between 4 and 5 30 and then Will's usually here so it's like I don't really have any time to film unless like it's a vlog like this so let me know down below in the comments if there's any like videos that you want to see from me and then I'll bulk film a bunch on the weekend because during the week I have no time like literally the only time I have is Saturdays because Saturday nights I go to Will's and then I spend the whole day Sunday with him so today my mom and I and my brother are going to a car lot. We both need to buy cars because my dad went back to work. We're in stage three now where I live, so the world's kind of opening back up. So he needs his car. My brother's also working and I'm also working. So my mom also needs a car to run errands during the day. We have two cars for four people. So me and my brother need to get our own cars. So we have four cars in order to, you know, be able to shuffle everything around. And, you know, we're also 24 and 25, so we kind of do need to grow up a little bit and not be dependent on my mom driving us everywhere so we're gonna go look at cars so I guess I'll bring you guys along will I buy a car today probably not but you never know hello <laughs> and brother say hello god we're gonna go look for cars are you excited Curtis sure do you think you're gonna find a car today no so the idea is going to be that you're going to look to see what jumps at you, what you see in your price range, and then you need to figure out what the insurance is going to be. Because you might come up with this amazing car and your insurance is $4,000 a month and that would be a, I don't think you can afford that. I don't know anything about cars, so know, I'm screwed either way. Is you know, figure out whether or not you want to finance this, which means pay monthly and pay a percentage interest, spend it let all. me finish, or see if you can buy it in one payment and see if you can get a lower price for it because like you're doing that. that. That's a good option for me. But, so you have to figure out monthly payments and that kind of stuff, and that's all stuff you do at home, right? Like it'll, it'll probably say on the sticker, you know, $8,000, 2% financing, can you pay $8,000 on the spot? Heck yeah, I can. But we should also ask dad if that's a better idea because by doing that, you also increase your um, credit rating. But both of you have very good credit ratings. The model child. Today is more just exploratory. See what's out there, see what jumps at you. We can go to a number of lots if you want. What's that for? <laughs> so much work. 
Can well, you just tell me what to buy, please? I'm so over this, and no, we haven't even started. No. I had said to Dad, I'm not sure how this is going to go. <laughs> Curtis, I Curtis don't care. might show interest. Jay, I don't will care. Not care. I just want to go down. home. I want to lie in my bed. I want to eat some cookies <laughs> and be done with it. I just want a car handed to me. Well, that's what it is. Like, I will pay for it's, it myself, but just tell me what to buy and we're you good. Want, you want somebody else to do all the legwork. Yeah, work. because this is too much work but, and I'm a princess. But buying a car is not like a... Why? Unless you are, like, stinky rich. Me. Okay, perfect. That's what we're doing. Perfect. <laughs> awesome. Bye. I've been told that I'm being very funny right now, so we need to... Did you say very funny? I believe you're just putting words in Did you mouth. say that? No, I, I didn't I say that. Did. That never came out of my mouth. No. No. I was told that I'm talking too much and need to don't. film <laughs> for content. Have you I'm read tired. any of those books, though? No. Then... I have read a lot of books. Thank you. You have, you have not. Not recently. How no, many actually, books I have, have you read three in almost two months. Seven last month, three this month. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. That's you want to know why? Turning down here. William, his fault. So this song. I gotta break up with him. I need to break up with him. Is That's now bad for them. The whole thing, moral of the story, is William's gotta go. Your, William, your if you're watching are being this. Let down. Peace out. I know. I feel bad. Well, he's that's why gonna, I'm he's vlogging. He's going to read this and go, what? He, <laughs> he's he, not going to say, you're not wrong. No, he does watch my videos and he'll like text me like things that I say and he'll be like, oh, or he'll like tell me like an answer to whatever I said in the video. I'm like, well, at least I know you watch my videos because my ex didn't. That's like, like what though? He's so supportive. I've decided I'm going to buy the police car. Thoughts? Go ahead. The man came to ask us questions and it I couldn't- It was real bad. I couldn't answer anything because I don't understand cars. No. Yeah, he's like, what car do you like? And I'm like, uh, I like a car with four wheels. <laughs> it go vroom. It go vroom vroom. And then he was like, I got a pretty blue car, I got a pretty white car. And I was like, okay, I still don't know get what we're talking about. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. Get a Jeep. I want, how do get I look Jeep. beside the Jeep? Do I look good? <laughs> Truck, maybe? That's or uh, another Jeep. Oh! That one. I don't know what I'm doing. What do you want? I don't know. What do you want? Something that's a car. I just want something that go vroom vroom, point A, point B, and I'm done. What about you? Well, I don't want this one. This one's two door. He wants, he wants a little car. I want a big car. That's as far as we've gotten so far. That's really all we've got. Yeah, so it's not going well. Round one equals failure. <laughs> failure. Expensive. They're too expensive and I'm poor. And this car salesperson looked like a fat Woody Harrelson. Mom says I'm wrong, but I'm right. I didn't say you were wrong. Because I'm right. She you said it was rude. Rude. Said you're rude. Yeah. I want that one. <laughs> that seems like a good option for me. Three dollars! <laughs> Lot number two. Thoughts? Failure. Not promising, but too expensive. We're poor. I can't afford this shit. <sighs> Third lot. <laughs> Failure! We'll destroy my bank account. No, but I, I don't think that any of us were used those cars, are also even though 20, it says 20s used. and 2021s. Yeah, it says used yeah. car lot, but they're all 2020, 2021. So lies? 2020, 2020, 2021. What kind of car did you get? I didn't get anything yet. He found a car and I, I did not. I like. It's a Mazda 3. Mazda 3. And Jay did not find a car and Jay is bitter. So what are we, we doing? We're going to BMW. We're going to another lot. Lot number oh, 5. Good and Audi, good and Audi. I'm poor. Hello, I'm panicking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm straight up not having a good time. <sighs> because his Cause he came out and? The salesman came he out and he had really tight pants and big muscles and he was like, how can I help you? And I started panicking because the last one we went to was really mean and he was like, buy a new car and I was like, I don't want a new car and he was like, but you have the money and I was like, I know I have the money but I still don't want it and then... Okay, stop. This is, listen. That's my baby. Except it's gonna be me over. Hello, I bought a car. We left at 1 and it is now 4.30. I bought a car. I have a receipt but we have to see if I can get good insurance. And then Curtis found a car, but did not buy it. He has to call, calm the car man back. Mm -hmm.
let him know. And this is my reward because I panicked and cried and bought a car. So that's good. Vlog for me. Hmm? Vlog for me. I do love you. No, I said vlog for me. Oh, you said love me. I was like, excuse me? No, vlog for me. What do you want me to vlog for? Can your... I been do it? It's your channel. Yeah, but they like you more. They like me more. Um, Verify that, please. Down below, leave a comment. Who do you like more? And you can't say both because you're not a mother to both of us, <laughs> so... Okay, say goodnight. No peace. Just love. Just kidding. Mess that up. No stress. Just love. No peace. It's been a long day. Bye. Peace out. Good morning. Good morning. It's Sunday. It's Sunday. We're getting McDonald's. And we're getting McDonald's! McDonald's! After a little princess here needs her iced coffee. I'm not a princess. You, should, you don't want to be a princess? Because I sure rescued... Rescued? <laughs> I rescued! I rescued you from your tower. Miss Fiona. Are you calling me ugly? Uh, no. Okay, I'll do everything. I no. want to give me. I can do it. I you am... are so aggressive. Thank you. I am independent. I'm really not. What's the plan for today? We're going shopping spree. Just kidding. My mom like, needs. For what? My mom needs bananas. My mom also needs salsa. Um, she also needs. There's one more. I forget. Tortillas. Tortillas. No, we need tortillas. Salsa, tofu. Tofu. That's what it was. Freaking gross. She's vegan. Yeah, gross. And all you, all you meat lovers out there, show me some support. <laughs> what did we get for breakfast? Egg McMuffins. Yeah, we did. Ooh. I got a bacon and egg McMuffin. I got a bacon and egg McMuffin. Oh, then why did you hand me yours? They're all bacon and egg McMuffins. Uh oh. Is that not what you got? Yeah, we're gonna go to Timmy's and get a wrap later. What? Can I have uh, a bagel? Yes, with cream <laughs> cheese and bacon on it. Okay, a, a four cheese bagel with herb and garlic cream cheese and bacon is like the superior breakfast. We have a friend. Kill the bug! No. Bugs are evil. We do not kill things on this channel. Oh, okay, well, we'll kill it when it's not being recorded. No! Sorry. Now we're at Tim Hortons. Yeah, we're fat. <laughs> And he got Timbits. What do you want to name him? Bruce. No, Bruce is my car. Bruce is literally the superior name. To no, Bruce is my car. What are we naming him? Steve. <laughs> okay. He looks like a Steve. No, he does not. My mom's vegan, like we were saying before. And we don't know if there's salsa she can have. Salsa she can't have. So we got to figure that stuff out too. So it's like... Lady, just go shop for yourself. I feel like salsa has to be vegan. Not all salsa is created equal. Yeah, but like what, what animal product can you put in salsa? It's like vegetables. Anyway. Bye. No stress, just love, even though I fucked it up the last time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what did I say? No peace. No just peace, love. just love. Which... We don't need peace! <laughs> it makes no sense. But I can get more shirts done this week because unfortunately my cousin's over. Fortunately though. Like love the guy. But that means I can't see Jay. Unfortunately. So I'll actually get reading done. <laughs> and I'll actually get shirts done! Wow! It's almost like we should go back to being single. <laughs> Just kidding. Wow, your face went from there to... <gasps> in like oh two my seconds. God idea. William's cranky today. I'm not cranky. <laughs> he just slept from one to five. No, I didn't. And I wanted him to watch Aristocats with me and he didn't watch okay. a single second okay. of it. Because I wanted to show him that I'm Marie and now he doesn't know because I watched Yes, it I myself. do. I watched like the first two seconds. I understand. And apparently, Wes snored, snored from snored like three to five. snored and snored. And I sat there trying to listen to a documentary, but all I could hear was and I'm now, not even sorry. Now he's really cranky. I'm not cranky. Just don't like to wake up and then be told you have to do this, 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 and this. To wake up and actually wake up before people start talking to me. Cranky. Whatever. We need to go back to bed. That can be arranged. Okay, good night. Nope. I mean, like, I will be up all night. 
Yeah, so uh, to those of you who don't know, I worry on afternoons now to midnights. Because we didn't tell them that before. Because I haven't vlogged. Yeah, because she doesn't vlog. She only vlogs when I take the camera out and vlog. Because I forget. How can you forget? It's what the people want. Because I'm not a very good booktuber anymore. Anymore, <laughs> because it's my fault. I'm looking read, there again. I read all afternoon, though. Maybe I just gotta sleep more. Yeah. Who knows? I got halfway through the book. Holy cow. We're allowed to cuss, right? Yeah. Okay, well, I'll say holy shit next time. Holy cow. Are you done? Making fun of you? Yeah. Probably not. Whatever. All right. Signing off for now. Bye-bye. So I just got home. It's like 10 o'clock now. Will just dropped me off because he has to go to work. And so now I'm going to end the vlog because I need to edit it. I figured before I end the vlog, I will tell you guys like my reading for the day because I actually did a lot of reading since Will slept pretty much the whole day because he's on midnight. So he's like really tired, which I don't blame him. Midnights are hard. So I got to page 142 of My Eyes Are Up Here. And that's like about 30% through I think Goodreads said so like I still got a lot of the story to go I think there's like 220 pages left of it or something but so far like I am really enjoying it I do really like Greer as a main character she's really funny but I don't think that it's going to be like a five star read for me like I'm thinking that it will probably be like a 3.5 or a 4 depending on like what else plays out in the story but so far like I said like I'm enjoying it yeah that's the end of this reading vlog because I need to go edit this but thank you for joining me on this reading vlog and I will see you all in the next video goodbye yeah.